Dragons represent what you would consider to be power. They represent many things, but raw power is one of them. And when many of you think of money, well, you're thinking of something that represents power because money for many of you can translate as your ability to do things within society. And ultimately, with enough money, many of you would compare that to your ability to do whatever you want. And that's a particular type of power. Now, dragons are, again, a symbol for this raw power. So when you align with the dragon energy, you actually begin to align with your own raw primordial power, which represents your ability to create your reality. And that is a form of abundance. Because when you recognize you have all the power that you need to create whatever you prefer within your life, you become an unstoppable force. And when you know that you are the one creating your reality, the power of that unstoppable force is reinforced. And in a sense, you become like a dragon. And of course, there are different varieties of dragons. There are different types of dragons. In general, the dragon power that most greatly corresponds with wealth would be what you would consider to be the golden dragon. This is a particular symbol that has connections to ancient royal lineages. And this particular symbol that is the golden dragon specifically is designed to attract positive energy. It's designed to radiate positive influence. It's designed to make someone's energy field, you could say, more dominantly anchored in the frequencies of positivity, thus making a person aligned with that energy immune to the negative energies that may be a part of the collective reality reflection. 